Gentlemen, first day of Oshkosh 2022. The storms are behind us. It's blue skies. There's nothing that could go wrong now because Piper is going electric. Tell me all about it. Wonderful announcement. You, if you were at Farnborough last week, you'll see your, th there was an announcement there. This is actually the second announcement that we're making and associated with CAE. Could not have a better partner than CAE. You know, we're going to be electrifying an aircraft, something that we've been working on for a long time. I think you're going to see us taking the leadership role. You're see, seeing the announcements of it, and that was going to continue. But we're typically tight-lipped, as you know, about what we're working on. Can you give us any kind of clue as to the specs you're shooting for in regards to the operational capabilities of an E-Archer? Go ahead, Ron. You want to take no, that one? That's or? fine. Yeah, it's going to be dependent on where CAE wants to go with, uh, and Safran is the partner with the motor, H55 is the partner with the batteries, uh, and what the capability. That's correct. Mm -hmm. uh, so again, wonderful partners for CAE and wonderful partners for Piper. Obviously, what we're going to be looking for is an aircraft with at least an hour duration in the practice area, 30 minutes reserve. With a fleet like CAE, it's perfect because if you have that many airplanes, you'll have about 75% of the aircraft dedicated with that capability for electrified for cross-country work about 25 percent so again to the students it's going to be a normal syllabus if you will the first several lessons will be in the pattern out to the traffic area when it's time for cross countries you'll get back into an avgas powered aircraft it's going to be fascinating to see how that develops especially with uh, CAE who let's face it has some a fair amount of chops in the flight training industry so where they go many will follow that, that's a fact, where they go and Piper goes. I mean, you could not have, well, I think what I said earlier was one plus one equals three in this case. Piper and CAE together, you probably could not have a better partnership in, the, in this endeavor. What's the future right now for the M600 program? So we will never apologize for innovating. If you notice, our 2022 <laughs> models had some enhancements. We didn't discuss them, they just kind of came out. I think you'll see more of that in the future. We are working on things. Spending money on R&D is really important to me, and, and we are spending quite a bit of money. Every aircraft we built, there should be an expectation for quality, and it should be innovative. Ron, the last time you and I talked, we were having kind of a counterpoint between chute and automated landing systems. What are the operators telling you now that they're beginning to get used to the concept? Are they finding that this is what is keeping the spouse happy and the other people happy versus the capabilities of a chute? Well, I think it's, it's the best of both worlds. What our customers are telling us is the automation is more important than the chute. To have that capability, not just in the case of a total incapacitation, but you got to remember there are times that in, uh, any of us flying airplanes, if we become disorientated, if we go into a weather spot that we shouldn't get into and we're getting too overloaded, you have that safety valve. That's recognized by our pilots and the, the spouses as well. And what, what we're seeing now is with the M600, it's been out since 2016, you have this derivative product strategy, you come out with something like Halo and automated systems, and the, the M600 owners are going back and buying a new M600, and you get to re regenerate your own customer base, which is really important. It's what derivative product strategy is all about. Gentlemen, thank you for spending time with us on day one Oshkosh 2022. Welcome to Virtufly. We create high-end flight controls, premium flight panels, and affordable certified flight simulators. From the user at home, the enthusiast, up to the most professional flight schools, and anyone in between. Check out our complete portfolio from the Yoko to Yo up to turnkey personalized solutions here on the website and contact us for any further information.